So, die sind die Zeugen. I'm Officer Phelps, Miss. I'm here about the shooting. Did you know the victim? <laughs> He was my boss. Mr. Gage. Mr. Gage's first name. Everett. Everett Gage. You are? Galleta. Clovis Galleta. Hmm. Okay. Dann... Fragen stehen auf der rechten Seite. Jo. Scroll mit B und S durch die Fragen und Beweise. Drücke die linke Maustaste, um einen Eintrag zu wählen. You think you could tell me exactly what happened, Miss? I look around the shops at lunch. I was in a store when Mr. Gage, my boss, bursts in yelling that I'm late on my lunch. And? We came back. I was angry. I walked in front. I heard shots. I turned and saw Mr. Gage fall. Dann läuft das an Züge. Lügt, wähle Lüge, um einen Zeugen der Lüge zu beschuldigen, musst du einen Beweis vorlegen. Drücke 3, um den Zeugen der Lüge zu beschuldigen. Naja, so wie sie hier durch die Gegend guckt und jeglichen Augenkontakt vermeidet, erzählt sie uns auf jeden Fall nicht alles, was sie weiß. Aber... Warte mal, die, die heißt Galetta, ne? Kann ich, kann ich noch mal sehen, was sie gerade gesagt hat? You're lying, Miss Coletta. You know what happened and why. You're going to tell me. There's nothing to tell. I've done nothing wrong. How can you prove different? Na, das Einzige, was irgendwie mit ihren Verbindungen steht, ist dieser Ratenzahlungsbeleg, ne? Your pearl earrings, Miss Galetta. You've been paying for them for a whole year. Stop lying. And tell me what happened at the jewelry store. Oh, God. I won't lose the earrings, will I? You could lose your freedom, you little fool, if you don't stop obstructing a murder investigation. Mr. Kalu. Edgar Kalu. He runs the jewelry store. He's showing me a lovely watch. Mr. Gage bursts in. Mr. Kalu gets very angry with Mr. Gage, and they start yelling at each other. Mr. Gage tells me that all of the things in the store are junk, nickel-plated, made in Japan, and yells at me to get back to work. Then what happened? We get back here, and I hear a loud bang. Mr. Gage clutches at his back. I hear another bang, and another, and another. Mr. Gage falls to his knees. It looked very painful. Okay. Erzähl mir mehr dazu. How many shots did you hear, Miss Galetta? It's difficult to remember. It sounded like there were so many. And they were so loud. Okay, also das Tutorial hat mir gerade gesagt, ich soll das jetzt als Wahrheit akzeptieren, aber so von ihrem Ausdruck. Na doch, sie guckt uns zwischendurch schon. Ja, komm. I need you to concentrate, Miss Galetta. Even minor details can become important later on. Well, there was one thing. <lacht> and then another. And then three very quickly close together. Five. Ja, okay, das, das stimmt ja tatsächlich mit dem überein. Okay, reden wir noch mal über den, wie heißt er? Edgar Kalu. Which jewelry store? Hartfields. Broadway, between 5th and 6th. Did you see the person who shot Mr. Gage? 
course I did. Mr. Callu looked very angry. He kept firing the gun. He kept pulling the trigger. He threw the gun in a bin and turned and walked away. Wenn du glaubst, dass ein Zeuge lügt, du es aber nicht beweisen kannst, wäre er anzweifeln. Ja, okay, das ist, das ist, das ist wieder relativ, relativ offensichtlich, dass sie da noch mit irgendwas hinterm Berg hält. Aber Leute, ich befürchte, da werde ich später noch richtig Probleme mitkriegen. Tell me why Mr. Kalu shot Mr. Gage. Mr. Gage hates Jews. A lot of people do. It's not my fault if he has nice things. Thank you for your help, ma'am. Been very brave. We'll need you to make a formal statement about what happened to Mr. Gage. Does that mean I can still collect my... my... Never mind. Yes, officer, I'll make a statement. Okay. Und wir? Gehen jetzt Jubilier Hartfields, Waffenladen Eaglesons. Ja, wir fahren jetzt dann hier zum, zum Jubilier, ne? Natürlich. We have the murder weapon. And the murderer. The girl saw it all. Our killer works at a jewelry store called Hartfields. That's a couple of blocks from here. Thinking what I'm thinking? Tate, maintain the perimeter. Wir müssen wohin und was erledigen. Und dann wüsste ich tatsächlich gerne so allmählich, wie ich ihn dazu kriegen kann, für mich Auto zu fahren. Lass uns jetzt gerade nicht. Jetzt sind wir um die Ecke und los geht's. Komm, 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 komm. Einsteigen, Junge, einsteigen, Junge, einsteigen. So, und los geht's. Oh, meine Güte. Die achten aber auch so überhaupt nicht darauf, was uns hier oben passiert, ne? Ja, ich meine, ja, ich habe mich auch nicht korrekt verhalten, so als richtiger Autofahrer, aber... Entschuldigung! So, hier ist der Jewelry Store. Ganz unauffällig, ganz schnell angerast kommen, bitte. Ja, ich werde, ich glaube, ab dem nächsten Fall werde ich mal ein bisschen vorsichtiger fahren. Officer, can I interest you in a new watch? Officer Cole Phelps, are you Edgar Kalu? Uh, no. Uh, Mr. Kalu is out back. He said he'd lie down. I'll buzz him for you. Und hinterher. Son of a bitch! Go, Cole, go! Hurry, officer! He's getting away! Kalu! Get back here! Mm -hmm. Wir warten mal. Shit. Stehen bleiben. Oh Mann, ich bin nervig. Aber hier müssen wir doch jetzt kriegen können, oder? Geht doch. Edgar Kalu, you're under arrest for the murder of Everett Gage. That's the case that makes you, and the case that breaks you. The one you never saw. The one that keeps you awake at night. The case that gnaws at your guts and ruins your marriage. The case that keeps you propping up a bar as you relive the what-ifs. 
the might have beens the half-leads, and the half-truths. The case that other cops murmur about whenever you walk past. The case you never, ever discuss. God's mill may grind slowly, but it grinds finely, son. I hear it's you who nabbed our malefactor from the shooting yesterday. Yes, sir. Then tell me, Boyle, I hear you're quite the climber, a man of initiative. How would you like a chance at smiting this man with the sword of justice? You're asking me to, to conduct the interview, sir? I am, young Phelps. You've only been with us a short time, and you've assembled yourself a stellar arrest record. Not to mention the fine work you did in the war, sending heathens back to the hell they came from. But I'm curious as to whether you can turn your hand to interrogation. It takes a certain animal cunning, lad. Do you think you might be ready for that? We can try, sir. Yes, sir. I think I am. Good man. You need many things for a conviction, young Phelps. A motive, opportunity, hard evidence, and best of all, a confession. If you fail in the former, you can always use a modicum of violence to obtain the latter. How are you feeling, lad? Fine, sir. Very good. The evidence is overwhelming. May the cat eat him and the cat be eaten by the devil. Bring me a confession, young Phelps. This is your chance. Don't fail me. Ja, dann schauen wir mal. Ja, wir wollen hinkriegen, oder? Wir sind doch gut. Has my lawyer arrived yet? I want to see my lawyer. A lawyer can't help you, Mr. Kalu. You shot a man dead in cold blood. You're going to have to pay for that. <lacht> ah, Entschuldigung. Das muss da einmal raus. So. Also, der Streit mit Gage. Reden wir doch mal darüber. You followed Everett Gage and the girl back to the shoe store. You put five rounds in Gage's back. Gage was a was a bastard. Whatever he got, he got what was coming. But it had nothing to do with me. Wow, wow, wow. Das können wir, glaube ich, direkt widerlegen. Da muss ich gar nicht gucken, wie er reagiert. Mutter mal Einsatz von Intuition. Was? Ich hab's wieder nicht gelesen, ne? Ich hab's wieder nicht gelesen, aber ist auch egal. Er sagt, es hat, it had nothing to do with it. Aber, verdächtige Person identifiziert. Lana Rochette sagt, dass Kalu Everett Gage nach einem hitzigen Streit erschossen hat. Also wir wissen, dass er lügt und wir können es widerlegen. You shot Gage and we know why. We can put you at the scene. You can't prove anything. Doch, doch, das kann ich. We know all about the argument. Miss Galetta made a statement. You're, you're counting on the girl? You think her testimony is going to stand up in court? You're going to the gas chamber, Edgar. That you hating fuck couldn't leave me alone. I had a sale. That girl was ready to buy. Okay. Let's change the subject. You fasting for Yom Kippur, Mr. Kalu? Yeah, let's change the subject, you going motherfucker. How about baseball? You're not denying you're a Jew, Mr. Kalu. This is America. It's not Germany. It's not a crime. Some people don't like Jews, Mr. Kalu. Yeah, and I guess you're one of them. Gage hated Jews, didn't he, Mr. Kalu? I don't know what you're talking about. Mögliches Motiv ist rassistisch bedingte Feindschaft zwischen Kalu und Gage. Soll ich da jetzt lügen oder anzweifeln? Soll ich jetzt lügen oder soll ich es anzweifeln? I don't know what you're talking about, hat er gesagt, ne? Wing leaning parasite. You expect me to sit here and listen to your drivel? You call me that? You sit there and you call me those names, you goddamn goy butt snatcher? You and that stup Gage! Why did you do it, Mr. Kalu? Gage. He's in the Chamber of Commerce. He's in with all those momsers. He blocked every proposal I ever put forward. Kike this and kike that. He's been trying to ruin my business for years. Edgar Kalu, I'm charging you with the first degree murder of Everett Gage. 
I respect your beliefs and your right to hold them. I hope for your sake the jury can commute to murder in the second degree. May God have mercy on you, sir. Okay, I think that's what you can do. I'm not sure. Masterfully done, Officer Phelps. It is just Officer Phelps. Isn't it, lad? Yes, sir. Then let me have a word with the Chief of Police, young Phelps. The department needs heroes. A shining, honest face the public can admire. I applaud a man with your talent for unwavering justice. Back to your duties for now, Boyle. But here's a piece <coughs> of advice. Get yourself two suits, get them pressed. You'll be needing them. Okay, Sir. Das lief doch eigentlich ganz gut. Und eine Errungenschaft freigeschaltet auch gleich. Streifendienst abgeschlossen. Du hast dir für deine Leistungen eine Beförderung verdient. Mach dich bereit für eine Versetzung. Der Offizier zeigt solide Ermittlungsmethodik, Befähigung an der Dienstwaffe, höchste physische Leistungsstärke und ausgeprägte Verhörinstinkte. Alles wird gut, Leute. Alles wird gut. Ich, ähm, ich würde einfach spontan nochmal sagen, das reicht für diese Woche, das reicht für heute mit L.A. Noir. Wir sehen uns Montag wieder, wenn wir unseren frischen, neuen Job in einer neuen Abteilung annehmen. Und bis dahin erstmal, ciao.